To create a market order, press on the Markets Order button in the main menu. First, you need to choose the order type. In this case, you can choose between Buy and Sell types. Let's start by going over the Buy Market functionality. In the next stage, you will need to enter the symbol you want to create an order on. Make sure to insert the symbol in the right format, with the coin name on the left, followed by a slash and the pair name. Then, you will be asked to choose a client in which you want to perform the trade. The bot will automatically filter the clients and only show you clients in which the symbol is available. In parentheses, next to the client name, you can see the available pair amount, which will be the maximum amount you will be allowed to use to create the buy order. In the next screen, you will be able to select the amount you want to use to create the order. The bot will display multiple options, it's showing a different percentage out of the maximum available pair amount. Please note that you might not see all the percentage options, as some percentages might correspond to amounts that are lower than the minimum amount that you can open an order on in the selected exchanges. Simply select the options that best matches your desired amount. In the next screen, you will need to choose whether you want to perform a market trailing buy or a regular market buy order. If you simply want to perform a regular market buy, choose the without trailing option. Alternatively, select the trailing percentage you want to use. Lastly, you will be asked to choose if you also want to set a trailing sell immediately after the market buy or trailing buy is executed, depending on the selection from the previous screen. The ability to perform trailing buy immediately followed by a trailing sell is a very powerful functionality and will allow you to maximize profit while minimizing risk in situations that otherwise might have been too risky to take advantage of. For example, it is possible to use the trailing buy with a trailing sell on a coin that is being dumped. In this case, you will only buy the coin when its price starts increasing again, and then the trailing sell will lock in the profits and the sell price will increase as long as the price increases after the dump. Now, let's briefly look over the market sell functionality. After selecting the sell option in the market order screen, you will be asked to choose a symbol out of a list of symbols that are currently available to you. These symbols contain all the coins you possess in all your clients, paired with all the pairs they can be traded against. After choosing the symbol, just like in the buy market case, the bot will filter and only show you the clients that the symbol is available in. In parentheses, you will be able to see the number of coins that are available to be sold to the chosen pair. In the next screen, select the desired percentage of the coins that you would like to sell. Note that you might not see all the percentage options, as some percentages might correspond to coin quantities that are lower than the minimum quantities the exchange allows to sell in a single order. Lastly, choose the trailing sell percentage or choose the without trailing option to perform a regular market sell. You should then receive confirmation that your sell order was performed. This is it for this video, see you next time.